Welcome, this is the energy vibration basin for the sun, moon, and rising. Um, this is the energy vibration and lesson for the sun, moon, and rising. Um, oh my god, um, um, you wonderful people, I want to say, um, um, welcome to another wonderful week um, I'm getting a lot of positive response from you guys because um, you're so awakening you're so understanding yourself more and this is good so thank you very much um, for um, the um, response thank you for being so um, wonderful and so supporting okay so for you obviously um, Sophie Dimenson um, it is a good time um, to be um, positive in this week because it's the energy of the tower um, not to worry it's just a week of cleansing the week begins from the 29 until the 4th of February and um, this is a time for each and everyone to open up to the universal angels and guidance that is coming in let's look at your week on Monday we have the energy of the seven of cups you're dreaming you're dreaming of new things to happen for you and these new things are going to come in so it doesn't really matter how they're going to come in they are going to come in okay then we have the energy of um, the tower this is a positive energy because it is the energy of a week and you guys receive the energy of the tower and this is good this is um, wonderful because the cleansing is coming on Tuesday whatever is happening there is going to be a cleansing on Tuesday on Wednesday you have the energy of the night of Clave, the night of the Clave of, of, of um, Stave the Clave of Stave um, is here um, and this is good a message is coming in oh my gosh I'm so sorry you have the two of swords it looks like the energy of the tower why am I thinking about the energy of the tower it is the two of swords my darling so um, you're dreaming of new things to happen and you have the energy of the two of swords I really I really need to wear my glasses so the energy of the two of swords comes in on Tuesday so that's um, um you have water um, water here and fire in these three days that is coming up so um, at least you're having some um, of all your energy and then you have the Clive of Pentacles that is coming to you on Thursday so as we move forward because uh, there's messages so there's messages news coming in about work for some people um, and that's going to be on Wednesday and for some people um, news coming in about money on Thursday so let's see what's happening on Friday your wishes and dreams are coming true on Friday so this is going to be very wonderful very um, good very positive your wishes and dreams are coming true and this is going to be good and positive so let's move forward and let's see what else is transpiring and what else is happening the Queen of Wands is coming up so your wishes and dreams are coming through the energy of the Queen of Wands is here this is yourself this is um, for some of you who carries a strong energy vibration of the Queen of Wands and then you have the Queen of Swords okay so you have the energy of the Queen of Wands and the Queen of Swords so you have two Queens um, so this is going to be um, this is really a balanced week um, the balanced week of the masculine energies and the feminine energies let's see what is going to be the energy for your week the Knight of Pentacles so the energy of the Knight of Pentacles remember that you guys are the only um you guys are the only person that um, carry all four energies okay the cups people carry two and the um, rest of the signs they all carry one and you carry and uh, two um, energies so um, this is positive and very um, good so as we look at your reading there is the energy of water um, air fire 
and the Pentacles so from Monday until Thursday oh my god <laughs> you guys have the energy of um, water uh, and, and all the four elements that is happening and this is what I'm saying to you guys is that there are so many so many so many different things that are happening there is so many different possibilities and situations that are happening and this is um, good this is positive this is um, um, wonderful good energies that are transforming in your life and this is going to be taking place for you guys and this is going to be good so it's a lot of emotional but good emotional because your wishes and dream you're open for something and this is going to be granted um, to do to you some of you are finally seeing a situation about the Queen of Wands you're finally seeing a situation about the Queen of Wands and a message is going to come to you from her there's also a message that you are going to be given to the Queen of Swords whoever that person is there is a message that you're going to give to them and the Queen of Swords is going to be um, holding up and accommodating to the energy of the Knight of Pentacles because the Squeeze of Swords is as if she is saying something about the energy of the Knight of Pentacles so let's see and let's go forward to see what other energies are here um, the three of Pentacles so um, the energy of the three of Pentacles is that you're dreaming of work whoever is out there dreaming of work this is going to happen um, in a very good way in a very good positive way work is going to come in for you so if there were people out there wishing for this dream job wishing for this job wishing for a special job this is going to happen for you your wishes and dreams are going to be coming true this is going to be very positive because a lot of you and now you're going to see a situation clearly what has really taken place and what has really transpired so we're going forward and we're looking to see what other um, charity do you're going to receive a help whatever is happening whatever is transpiring you are going to be receiving help or giving a help okay and there is a message that is coming in that you are going to be receiving help this help is um, um, you know you're seeing a situation clearly and the message of the six of Pentacles is coming in and saying a message is coming to you to, from someone who has a fire sign to give an helping hand to you and this is going to be good okay so let's look and see what else is here um, romance the two of cups there is a new romantic relationship that is going to come in and this romantic relationship that is going to come in um, is coming from a situation or a person that could be um, um, an Aries Leo or a Sag um, Aries Leo or a Sagittarian or it could be coming from someone who is a Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn this romance could be a romance that is also happening for people who carries an eye energy vibration of a queen of swords because this queen of swords some of you could be having relationships with this queen of swords or some of you could be romanticizing a relationship with this queen of swords okay so um, working together receiving help giving help is going to be the vocal point of um, this week for you guys because you are going to see that help is going to be coming in a wonderful situations and possibilities and that sort of a thing is going to be coming through okay um, um, between Monday and Tuesday you need to find the balance whatever is happening you really really need to find balance in whatever situation that is happening the energy of the temperance is coming up here to say that you need to find balance no matter what is going on find the time um, and have a um, balance in whatever you are doing okay um, ten of one um, oppression um, there is a situation of um, you feeling oppressed but not to worry because help is going to be coming in if there is such a thing as you feeling oppressed there's going to be help coming in six of cups is here 
and what is happening this energy of the six of cups and situation that is happening with the messages that is coming in and uh, um, from the conniver and uh, the the conniver from um, ones and the conniver from Pentacles this is a situation that is a childhood connection that has a karmatic situation that is coming in okay so let's go ahead and let's look and see what is happening you have the ace of Pentacles the ace of Pentacles so this is going to be good because um, now you're seeing that whatever that was transpiring whatever that you were dreaming for you are now seeing that it is going to come to pass and the energy of the three of cups and uh, three of um, pentacles which you're working forward towards something and um, bringing it in balance your wishes and dreams are going to come out because you have the energy of the ace of pentacles and this is a positive positive situation because carrying the ace of the energy of the ace of pentacles is that they are letting you know that have patient and um, balance work hard because the financial reward is going to be coming and it's going to be good you have the energy of the princess of swords and the queen of swords so whoever is um, carrying the energies of the um, princess of swords and the queen of swords whoever these two people are it is okay for them um, and it has to do with a situation with romance and that sort of a thing so whatever is transpiring um, with these people I would say to you just step away um, obviously this is a situation where there is a lot of um, um, there there is a lot of um, people that is working against you and that sort of a thing and here is the energy of you seeing a situation clearly now and it's okay you're seeing a situation clearly now and it's okay because no matter what is transpiring um, people are people and um, you choose your part whatever part you want to move on to and no matter what is transpired know that you are going to be overcoming each and every one of these obstacles that is happening in your life okay there is um there is a, a saying that says um um, no weapon shall fall against me and you know this is a phrase I remember on the first of um, on Christmas Eve the first of January um, the night between Christmas Eve and the night a friend of mine called me and he says to me um, I want you to know this and I said why are you calling I thought you would be in church and the person said no I want you to know this um, no weapon that fall against you shall prosper absolutely not and I was like thank you so much and I, I, I was just blown away I was really really just blown away from this person calling so far from overseas to let me know this I was like oh my god I am being protected um, by um, I am being protected by um, you know the universal angels and guides because um, obviously they needed um, me to know and get this message and I was like because I really know um, that verse it's, it's like no weapon fall against um, you shall ever prosper okay so it's as if whatever people are planning for you it's not going to work out because there's a higher power that is guiding you and protecting you and this is what I always say and I remember there was a situation and I said to the person um, you know and just just like this laughingly and I said you know doesn't really matter how much money someone can give out to hurt me it's not gonna happen and this is it positive thoughts and, and, and really knowing and believing and have the faith in the universe that the that no one can affect you in, in any way then you will see whenever people try to do that it will fall like as if it's candle running off of um, a very hot iron stage so ladies and gentlemen 
believe in yourself and know what is the power of faith the power of faith can move mountains and trust me I have been through it all and know that when you have faith you can move mountains confusion there is no confusion because we are going to see exactly what is happening okay this seems to be there is a situation that is going on because there's an energy of romance um, there's an energy of romance there's an energy of the two of cups there's an energy of romance that is happening and confusion the energy of romance and confusion um, some people seems to be looking for their soulmate some people are in the sense because as you look at this the energy of romance the two of cups you're trying to find your your soulmate because you have the six of cups which the six of cups um, is the energy of um, the six of cups is the energy of a past life relationships so those are your soulmates and your um, those are your soul soulmate and your um, twin flame and this is what is happening there seems to be a confusion um, that is happening and this romance has something to do with um, someone who this woman is a, um, a, a the, the sword the, the the queen of sword so some of you could be um, having soulmate relationship with um, someone who is over 40 or um, 25 too um, and with over 40 and there is a confusion of is this person the person um, that I should be with that sort of a thing that sort of a situation so obviously there is a situation that is going on there are situation that is happening and you need to understand that you need to face up to certain situation call upon the angels of love um, to heal whatever the situation that is transpiring between you and this person and really remove the confusion remove the confusion that is happening between you and this person and understand that um, um, and the power of fate and the power of the universe and the power of the spiritual world is actually um, good because what is going to happen and what is going to transpire is that whatever confusion whatever confusion that is happening you or it, it's going to clear up I ask the universal angels and guide to clear up the confusion that is happening between myself and my soulmate um, so that this whatever is transpiring you can use this energy because whoever is doing um, whoever is there is someone there is um, some of you had a situation with someone um, with these air sign people so these air sign people are Aquarians um, Libra and Gemini's and some of you had a situation with this person or these two women because they're both in the reading and it has something to do with romance and they seems to be making a con um, making things confused between you and your soulmate and there are sick people in this world I have to admit to that um you know there are really some sick people into this world and uh, people can use negative energies to um, disemplace some people sorry I need to make a photo for you <laughs> and this is what is happening so ladies and gentlemen please like share these videos thumbs up and I'm saying namaste until next week